coronavirus evolves after spreading between people. Consequently, the virus changes and becomes different from the original virus. The changed virus of the coronavirus is called the variant of coronavirus. Scientists map the genetic material of viruses to understand the difference between the original virus and the changed one. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention classified the coronavirus variant in four categories. That is, variant being monitored, variant of interest, variant of concern, variant of high consequence. A variant that is being monitored by scientists comes under the first category. Variant is considered a variant of interest if it has mutations that are suspected or known to cause significant changes and is circulating widely. A variant of interest becomes a variant of concern if it is known to spread more easily, cause more severe disease, escape the body's immune response, change the clinical presentation, or decrease the effectiveness of known tools such as public health measures, diagnostics, treatments, and vaccines. Besides this, the fourth category of coronavirus is variant of high consequence, which significantly reduces the effectiveness of prevention measures and efficacy of medical countermeasures. This variant was identified in the U.S. first time in January 2021. The infection ability of this virus is unknown because it affected a limited number of people. WHO classified this variant as a variant of interest. It was first reported in Peru in December 2020. According to data from the GISAID COVID tracking initiative, there were nine cases globally that were associated with Lambda. It has been largely responsible for driving the second wave of coronavirus infections and was first identified in India. It has since mutated into the variants I.1 and I.2. WHO lists Delta as a variant of concern. The Indian government has classified Delta Plus as a variant of concern in the country. This mutant of Delta was first detected in Europe in March 2021. Omicron is a new variant of SARS-CoV-2 that has recently been reported from South Africa on November 24, 2021. This variant has shown a very large number of mutations, especially more than 30 on the viral spike protein, which is the key target of the immune response. Scientists in France have identified a new strain of coronavirus with more mutations than the Omicron variant. The cases have been linked to travel to the African country Cameroon. The Omicron variant has a large number of mutations compared to other variants of coronavirus. The Omicron variant spread more easily than the original SARS-CoV-2 virus. A person having an Omicron infection can spread the virus to others, even though vaccinated. It is expected that current vaccines shall protect against severe illness, hospitalizations and deaths due to infection with the Omicron variant. Polymerase chain reaction PCR, tests continue to detect infection with Omicron. However, scientists are working to ascertain any impact on other types of tests, such as rapid antigen detection tests. Corticosteroids and IL-6 receptor blockers will still be effective for managing patients with severe COVID-19. However, scientists are working to assess whether other treatments are still as effective on new variants including the Omicron variant.